Here on our fellows, here we go. We got some of them from the other side. On this side. Anthem. Indian Pale Ale from Fremantle. Now this one's interesting because it's made by a group of musicians. And part of the money that comes from this goes to helping artistic or musicians, I guess. Let's just say musicians. So hopefully it's a ripper. It looks pretty good. Slightly filtered. Not uh, crystal clear like a lot of IPAs. Only 6.2%, which is, you know, an extra strong pale or a, a light IPA. But what isn't light because they haven't over filtered it, even though I like them filtered, but they've retained some really nice flavours. So that's pretty tidy actually. That's really nice. A straight up good IPA. Well balanced. Yeah, not too bad. It is what it is. Oh well. Get on board if you want to help the music industry. I've supported the music industry all my life. I've gone and, well, a long time ago I'd be out every night probably six nights a week watching bands all over Australia and then around the world. Watched a lot of live bands. Roadie for a few bands, Switzerland and Wales. Um, my cousin was a roadie for ACDC, Cold Chisel, Dragon. I used to hang out with him quite a bit. Uh, I live with a a band manager in Holland, the guy that organised Pink Pop. <clears throat> yeah, I always hang out with band members and managers, musicians. No, oh, it's great. I love music, so that's all part of it. Well done. Other side, chip that money in. Get that artistic ability out on the radio or wherever, you know, YouTube, doesn't matter these days, there's so many avenues, you've got to find the avenue, find the um, audience. All good, lovely. Yeah, nice, nice um, IPA without being crazy, but um, yeah, easy drinker. There you go. Alright guys, I'll leave you on that one, just a short one, it's getting cold out here. You believe it, I've got a wind cheater and a jumper on, and it's still cold. You're kidding. It's friggin' November. It's like a bloody winter day again. Kid. Cheers guys.